first we can see here that we are on the Ethereum network. Uh, you do need a MetaMask and Trust Wallet doesn't work for this, so make sure you use MetaMask. Uh, the first thing we should do is add a, a new network and you do that by clicking on the top right. Go to Custom RPC and there, I will link this in the uh, description, you can add a network and all this information can be found in the description but I will show you shortly now if you just google phantom network metamask you will find it too here you will find the explanation as well and these are the things you have to copy and paste into your metamask it's really not that difficult to do but we'll do it here as an example you don't have to worry about these if you fill them all in it will automatically add the new network so we do all this we save it and now we can see that when we click this away we are on the phantom network and phantom is the uh, the main token that is used on the phantom network of course so that's why we see phantom here uh, you should add the binance smart chain network too and you can find this in the description as well i will look it up here right now but it's it's really it's the exact same here you just copy all of this information right here so let me do that it shouldn't be too hard and here we go and we can save this and we can now see that we are on the Binance Smart Chain network and that's great because we can swap between certain networks we can swap between the Ethereum network the Smart Chain network and the Phantom network uh, but we will only need the Binance Smart Chain Network and the Phantom Network. The next thing we can do, um, if Phantom is not tradable, uh, this works for people in the United States as well, as far as I know, is you can send some BNB uh, to this account. Uh, it doesn't matter how much, as long as you have some liquidity in it. And then the following thing you can do is you Google Spooky Swap, which is a Phantom Swap, which is a decentralized exchange in the Phantom network. Now we can go to Connect Wallet, go to MetaMask, and click on Next. Uh, yes, and let me connect. And here. We can now see that it wants to switch us to the Phantom Network because we are still on the Binance Smart Chain Network. But we don't have to do this because the first step we want to do is go to Bridge, select the... Oops. All right, here we go. Select the BSC Network to the Phantom Network. Now we can select BNB. And if you have bought some BNB, it will appear here. Uh, you, you should not click on max because you still need some liquidity so don't use the maximum right? but subtract a little bit from it and then all you have to do is click on bridge token and this will only take I think a, a maximum of 5 minutes maybe and then the token will appear instead of on your Binance Smart Chain network it will appear on your Phantom network and that's great because you now have BNB on the Phantom network and all we have to do next is use these, uh, the same exchange, go to swap, and here we can select BNB, as you can see, <coughs> excuse me, and you can swap this into Phantom, and now you can select however much of your BNB you want to swap to Phantom, and uh, it will do it automatically. It's, it's not now. You can leave the slippage on the same level as well. Um, but one thing you should use here 
is if you want to swap like this, um, you should be on the Phantom Network for this time, and we are on the Phantom Network as you can see right now. But there's one problem. You probably don't have any liquidity in Phantom because you want to buy some Phantom. So there is one easy solution. I will leave the link to this Discord in, this, uh, in the description of this video too. But uh, so you join the Discord, continue to Discord, and then you will be redirected to Discord. I already have it on Discord. So let me show this. If you are on the uh, Spooky Swap network here, then you can go to, you can move to something called a faucet. I don't know if my pronunciation here is right, but uh, this is how it works. You type an exclamation mark and then faucet. And I've already used this, but uh, it's really useful because each month this bot, this Discord bot, will send you uh, some liquidity. So, for example, you can see that the person above me has just received 0 0.3 Phantom. And the next thing you can do is type uh, exclamation mark withdrawal and then since we have still our uh, we still have our MetaMask open, we can click on this again, copy our address here, and the next thing you will see is that you can withdraw from this Discord board onto your MetaMask, and this is really useful because you now have most of the time it's about zero point one Phantom in your account, and you can use that to transfer or to swap the BNB to Phantom. Um, so these are quite a few steps, so let me um, conclude this video by giving a short summary of what we just did. You have added the Phantom Network, um, as I've just shown you. All you have to do is set up the Binance Smart Chain Network, which you most people have already done this because uh, Binance Smart Chain is very popular. So all you have to do is set up your Binance Smart Chain Network, um, add some BNB to your wallet. You can do this from Binance, you can do this from any exchange. You just have to copy your account code right here. Um, then you go to SpookySwap, you bridge it from the Binance Smart Chain to the Phantom Network using BNB. The next step is getting some liquidity from the Discord. The last step is going to the swap and swapping your BNB on the Phantom Network uh, from BNB to uh, Phantom.